JJ, the CPA here, hope you're doing well. So as a practicing CPA, working with clients, whether business owners or individuals, anytime I see a need come up related to their finances, if you will, in times of disaster, I try and share information. So that's what I'm doing here in this video. I just need you to know that if you're in a natural disaster, recovering from it, I hope you're doing well. I hope you get back to normal as soon as possible. Through the SBA, the Small Business Administration, there are several kinds of loans that are available to help you. The key word is their loans. But this isn't just for small business owners, it's also for homeowners and renters, believe it or not. So if you are somebody that is recovering from a natural disaster, then go to the link uh, in the body of this video, which is just simply at sba.gov and look for disaster relief. And there you will find these different applications to get this relief. Again, these are loans. They're 30 year loans to no more than 4% uh, interest rate, but homeowners, you can get up to 200,000 uh, for whatever insurance is not covering related to your actual residence. Um, renters and homeowners can also get then 40,000 for their personal belongings inside that residence. Small business owners, you can get a loan for physical injury to your business from a disaster. And then separately, small business owners, you can get the Economic Injury Disaster Loan, the EIDL. Now, we heard about these during the pandemic, but these loans, the EIDL and these others, have been around well before the pandemic. So the SBA has wonderful experience in helping those that need these. So the biggest key is that you want to wait until your area has been officially declared a disaster area. Even if you're looking around and you say, how is this area not already declared? Well, it does usually take a couple of days, maybe a week. Unfortunately, because we're talking about getting everything lined up for your area to be declared a disaster area, which means that then it's green light time to go ahead and apply for this loan if you need it. And from that standpoint, seek the relief that you need. There might be some grants related to it. Don't want to get into that in the sense that if you need help, check out the SBA website. I'm going to give you a link again so that you can go and find out if any of this would be of help to you. So all my best to you. And with that, I will just end every video the way that I end them, which is, all right, thanks for tuning in. I'd love it if you'd subscribe. And then don't you ever forget, you've never met anybody just like you. So you're strong. You're going to get through this. And uh, all my best to you. Many blessings.